Well, hello and welcome. So this is a little project I've been working on with a few friends or so, you know, and uh, I actually will have more videos on like the construction on this. This is actually on a survival world, uh, getting ready for the new update of uh, 1.20. So that's going to be exciting for all of us. And uh, I've been trying to accomplish a full underground bunker that's fully automatically sorting and that will house every single item in the game and try including trying to even get all the items from uh, 1.20 so uh, I'm really excited to do that and I want to share a little piece of this this is done on hard and survival and all the way through and you know I uh, will upload more videos about uh, the construction of all this it's been a whole lot of fun and hope you guys uh, enjoy it and let's get let's uh, get started all right. Well, this is actually the uh, what uh, what my buddy Captain Kraken built. Oh, excuse me. Uh, what Captain Kraken built here? He planted all these trees and started building something up there. I have no idea what that's going to look like in the future. But we got uh, going down into the bunker. Captain Kraken did this whole layout. This is great, done by him. As we go into the my B room, definitely got to do something about that another portal. That uh, we got to figure something out there. So here it comes down to the first floor of the bunker, and designed it to be a completely item sorter build. I have all the blocks. I'm still trying to categorize everything here. At the end here, of course, we gotta have our iron farm, of course. So, I'll give you guys a little peep at that little setup. Um, some of these builds were partially from, like, uh, I did a, another world before that was similar to this, but didn't quite work out. Um, but, uh, like, uh, Definitely, I watched a lot of Jay Z plays and uh, Silent Whisper. That's for sure. A lot of those guys do some really good stuff, and I've designed similar, or you know, done pretty much similar or the same thing as them before. And this one I slightly altered, I guess, but you know, it's built from them, their design, and uh, it's really nice to be able to trade with uh, some villagers too, all at the same time in your bunker when you need uh, to get some diamond tools and stuff or diamond gear or really like the mine for it and just train them iron when it's free it's a good little trick there get good uh, early game start in order for the bunker to, to function here well I got if you guys are wondering about the drips it's actually honey from bees just getting stuck yeah that happens from the design I've noticed so a full-on smelting done by my buddy Black. He, uh, he actually built this little sort of smelting. It's very, very efficient. Burns down practically. You put the lava in here and put all your burns up top and it all sorts down. You got four going into it and everything dumps off into one chest. Oh, I still got to empty my inventory, you guys. Oops. I've been busy. I'm gonna collect up some lava here real quick. I gotta gotta keep it filled. This is a hungry, hungry, hungry machine to feed. Of course, you gotta you know have the lava farm. You know, completely self-sustaining bunker is the design with it being an automated sorting system. Yeah, like pretty much all these are just filled. Let's put that back. Please excuse me while I go to sort. Do I have? Oh, yeah. here's some anisite. Gotta get rid right of that. Looks like some stone, cobblestone. <clears throat> Clear up my inventory real quick here. Uh, 
Oh yeah, I do have. Yeah, for now, you know, just trying to get everything in place. It's not everything, nothing set in stone yet, technically. Ha uh, pun intended. Um, I might switch things around as progressed uh, to put more items more near each other. Of course, it's kind of nice to be able to put all, you know, everything together, <coughs> including the raw ores. Oh, why don't you smelt it down? Well, at the end of the day, we all do have, you know, our silk touch pickaxes, but when you start producing so much in the bunker, it kind of, you know, makes it a little difficult. And yeah, here's one of the hardest blocks to really come by. It's actually just the ore block of an emerald or deep slate coal is one of the other ones. And I haven't got that. These are deep slate ores. So in case you just throw it in the sorter, every block is sorted out. Anything that's stackable item in the game will be sorted out through here. Got a little mini tree room here. Gotta have my wood. Something really small. Got a little or bone meal maker. <clears throat> The main main floor onto the half floor. And yeah, this will be all categorized and everything. Got my nice little enchantment table there, of course. Give you guys a tour. Yeah, I'm still like there's a lot of empty slots. It's still early game. But I know that these will all be filled eventually. Gotta, gotta have all the plants. Get a whole little bunker. Yeah, I'm just running through on survival. Getting hungry here. I just made this my bedroom. This will be changed out later. I have an egg problem. I'll show you that in a moment. Something I do not recommend people to do. But if you want a lot of eggs, just over time, is that literally you can just put chickens over hoppers, stuck under hoppers, and you will be stuck with eggs. It will produce eggs. I have my cows and stuff. I gotta get the sheep and stuff down here too, eventually. So, I mean, there's more animals to pigs. I have a little bit of everything. Sorry, doing the wool down here. Still gotta collect up more of that. And of course, the famous gold farm, of course. Great early game farms, must have. The dual portal setup. It uh, works way too good. One portal actually suffices for this like design. Uh, overkilled it definitely on this one. And yeah, it's just pretty much an upgraded version of uh, Jay Z plays um, one he does onto the, down to the third floor, which is still under construction. Which, uh, we will, uh, definitely get back to that a little bit later. Thank you for joining me on this little adventure. I hope you guys enjoy this. Uh, hope to see the future. A little me building this, everything. It's going to be, uh, it's many, many hours of, uh, recording so far to get this far. And, uh, hope you guys enjoy this. And let me know down in the comments and like and subscribe. And, uh, yeah, catch you guys on the flip side.